What's up, Paleans? Test, test, we the best. We have audio. It's your boy Kovu. How you guys doing? So today we're going to be touring. Finally, we're going to go to uh, Tish's dream house and see what's going on out here, what this is all about. Um, hopefully it's not anything too boring because, you know, I hate decorating and things. Oh, what are, what are these? Oh, these are react to the home? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, escape to cancel. I'll think about that later on. Let's go take a look really quick. Um, these purple flowers, do we have these? You guys know I don't decorate, so I don't know if we have these things or not. But okay. Alright, Tish. That's kind of that's nice, I guess. I think I've seen some players with better stuff. We just got these, so... Uh, these are like some brand new things that we just got in the game. Nice. Nice. We just got this as well. I haven't quite unlocked this yet, but I'm working on it. But it's cool to see what it looks like. Very nice. Okay. Check it. Has her stuff like individually sectioned out. I feel like this is like a. Um, this is less of a dream home thing. And I have the feeling that this is going to be like more of a. These are things to come, Paleans. Like these are things that. Do we have this couch? Can I sit? I can't sit. These couches, these couches won't let me sit. Um, I see the pot here that looks like it has dark cloves in it, which is interesting. Okay. These looks like... Wait, what are these? What plants are these? Like turnips and radishes or something? But keep in mind, guys, again, I don't decorate, so I'm probably not the best person to actually talk about this stuff. <laughs> um, but I figured I want to give it a look and see what I see what I say. I love this wallpaper. I don't know if that wallpaper is actually in game or not, but that's a cool wallpaper. Oh, well, I have, this looks like the is this a ranch house bed with a different color scheme to it. That's actually kind of nice. I kind of like that. Yeah. This is this is pretty simple so far. Nothing too complicated. Everything seems to be sectioned out very well in here. So my initial thoughts about this place um, was that it was going to be more of a let me show you some things that are already in game and some things we don't even have in game yet. Like the fact I can't sit on these couches is really kind of bothering me. Um, we continue we'll see what else we have here it's like a jar full of shells or coins or something let's see if we can get a closer look what is this yeah shells and sand and things okay book got the bug plush in here i can't change in here as well interesting so it's like nothing in here is really interactable, which is interesting. Hmm. I do like how the courtyard kind of extends into the other rooms, which is kind of nice. I do, I do have to say I appreciate that a little bit. Um, okay. Again, her stuff seems pretty simple compared to some of the uh, other Paleon houses that I've seen so far. Nothing too fancy schmancy quite yet. Nothing that really pops out to me. Um, the one thing I haven't seen in her house yet are any like of the star gems. I haven't seen any of those yet, so I wonder if she has those at all. We got Einar's music box here, which can't even be played as well. Uh, nothing in here is interactable. I wish it was, though. It's a bunch of flowers here. What flowers are these? So I know that these aren't in the game yet. That's why I kind of that's why I kind of assumed when I was first thinking about like coming in here and looking at Tisha's stuff was that we're gonna see things that aren't in the game for us yet. Like I don't think this one is either. That when it kind of swirls like that. So I don't think these flowers, some of these flowers aren't in the game yet, but the fact that they have them already in the game and they're in Tish's place kind of gives me the idea of, uh, let's go upstairs first, kind of gives me the idea of we're going to be getting them 
very, very soon. It's a big old painting of Ashura, and it's it's a different size painting of Ashura. It's not the one that, that we get as a player, so I don't know how she got that, but okay. I never paid attention to this, to be honest with you, but yeah, he does have a little bit of gray in his beard. Got the Proud Horn Cernuck bug. Not, not Cernuck, sorry. Proud Horn Beetled plush right there as well. I'm trying to see if the man in this picture up here, because I never really looked at the photos until now. Is that Hossian? I can't go into picture mode to take a closer look. But I think that's Hossian and Tau. Just the hair looks slightly different. So we already had that picture of Wrath, and a lot of people actually had that picture of Wrath. Um, I'm assuming this is a picture of Sabine, who was, uh, and still is technically, um, Ashura's wife, who has passed, unfortunately. She has an Autumn plushie, which we don't have this one yet. So we have all of them as far as my understanding and even the the dark purple and black one which i i think is my favorite so far we don't have the autumn plushie yet so i think this these are things that are like on their way like they're they're coming very soon um we have this plush already i believe we just got this plush as well too i haven't really checked just got the regular mujin plush there's the gems i was waiting to see when she's going to kind of bring those out a little bit okay elder cernuk I like this so far. Proud Horn Cernuk. And another Elder Cernuk? Wait. No, this is a regular Cernuk. Sorry. It just looked darker than I thought it was. Okay. The fact she has a star quality ruby in here makes me kind of upset. But, you know, it's to be expected. She got that NPC look. Okay. Um, let's go this way first. So this is like a little kitchen area. All right. Not seeing anything too fancy schmancy in here. Just trying to see if we were gonna see any uh, like new appliances or something. Cause we made a joke. Me, it was me, Corey, and a couple of people had a, had this running joke where uh, let's finish out the house first before I go outside to the uh, other house out there. We had this running joke where they were adding in laundry baskets and all these other kind of things. I said, it'd be actually hilarious if they put in like uh, laundry machines and dryers as like <laughs> a thinking game as well too. And I was like, you know how many people would love that? To have like an actual laundry machine and dryer thing going on. This is just, this is, uh, what is that? It's this gold thing. I want that. Oh, is that the plot trophy? I never, I think I might already have that. Interesting. So far, so good. This is nice too. I like that. Um, so she basically put all the like things you can buy from NPCs in here, as well as some of the hunting trophies and stuff as well. Bug catching trophies. So she, this is kind of like her little trophy space, which is nice. I dig it. All right, so check out this outside room. I think I got lost already. There's a back door somewhere. I just gotta find it. Where is it? Um, oh, it's through here. It was in the it was in the other room. Sorry. It's over here. You take a step back here. Oh, she's got her garden over here too. I'm gonna divert to the garden first, and then we'll do that last room. So she's got this gold thing going on here, which is in the shape. Is it in the shape of a? Wait, is it in the shape of an Ormu? That's actually really kind of creative, dude. That's actually super creative. Or is it in the shape of a choppa? I can't... I think it's supposed to be a choppa. I can't really tell. That's actually... That's actually pretty cute. I had to give her credit on that. It's either an Ormu or a choppa. One of the two. These are just all the... Workstation area stuff. Let's take a look at her garden real quick. She's got the little red bricks going around. She needs to weed. Wait, can I water these? I can't. I can't water her crops. Her crops need to be watered. Oh, man. Unfortunate. Sorry. Sorry, Tish. I tried. Okay. 
let's see. It's nice, nice. I don't know what this is. Do we have this in game already? No? Yes? I want one if we don't. Um, this was at the guest house. It's a nice little design. I like it. Got an emerald out here. Okay. It's a nice vibe so far. With the hot tub in the back, that's actually a really nice detail. I enjoy that. I didn't even see these. I ran right past them, but okay. Let's make a another quick little deviation here. Another hot tub over here. Um, just trying to make sure we didn't miss anything. Yeah, I think I kind of went through everything here. This was, uh, this was okay. This was cool. I didn't step in the front door, actually. Yeah. So this is one area that I didn't miss. And I kind of like this setup, actually. This actually reminds me a lot of, like, my home setup, actually. Um, but I'll say that, uh, this was cool. This was cool. So I think if I'm going to rate it, I'm going to rate it like, okay, there's an emote that literally looks like cool. And I think I'm going to go with this. This is how I'm going to react to it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. On that note, we return home. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you guys for watching this with me. Thank you guys for chilling with me. Uh, this has been Tish's Dream House and what I think. Let me know what you guys think about the Dream House. For me, it was it was cool. Like, it wasn't anything too special. But it was okay. I do like seeing some of the new stuff that I feel like we don't have yet. Um, and I feel like that's kind of what her house, in my personal opinion, was going to be anyway. Like, I kind of feel that... Uh, every week or it usually do updates every month so every month we'll probably see something new that's being added to her house or maybe we'll get like other villagers houses or whatever and what their dream houses are we'll see but we'll probably have items in there that are new to the game that we don't have yet but are probably like hints of things to come in my personal opinion but who knows i guess we'll just wait and see if they change anything next month or if they add anything next month i'll see you guys then until then goodbye <laughs> You all just look so angry. I know. Oh. Okay, okay. Somebody nice. lost a boy, Ray. That's unfortunate. <laughs> <laughs> Instant just anger return to the face. It's like you don't want to be here. <laughs> Why is this so upset? Dude. I've never noticed this before. Is everyone's eyebrows like this? Let me walk around, do a quick survey. And it just naps back down. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, their eyebrows are normal. Good for you. It's just us <laughs> on this side over here. <laughs> Good for you guys. It's just your character's eyebrows. For some reason, you guys are angry. <laughs> What about Froggy? Does Froggy Wait, have Wait, Angel's eyebrows, eyebrows fix themselves? Okay. Yeah. Not for me.